Hello, welcome back to our channel, Favorite Inspiration of You can subscribe, like, share, comment, and turn on your notification bell so that you'll get updated. Thank you. As a principle, there is no visionary leader who will keep beckoning on you to come closer as you dishonor increases. No, leadership is such that once people tell you take a step, they observe your sense of honor. If it remains consistent or ever growing, then you have signed up for more. Are we together now? This is true. Jesus had several disciples. He had 72, he had 12, he had two, and he had one. And the name of that one was the beloved. The beloved. Something about his sense of honor. When I learned this principle, because you see, I didn't come from a background that had so much advantage. I knew I was going into ministry. I knew what God had put upon my life. And I said, if, if I do not understand this law, I will never rise. Let me tell you, I submit to you. This law has opened doors that, oh dear. There are things that gifts and talents cannot bring you. Believe me when I tell you this. Honor is powerful. Honor to God. Honor to men. Honor to principles. It is also the reason why, now respectfully speaking, did you notice that in most homes or organizations, and sadly even churches strangers seem to be the greatest recipient of that grace have you have you noticed this as a trend generally it is why it's easy to believe that certain miracles or testimonies are stage managed because most people who are within either that church or that organization continue to wonder why is it that our boss our ceo our pastor it seems like we we are not receiving all of these things there in fact there are men and women of god who deliver more when they are outside of their churches they minister with power because they are received they are welcome the expectation the hunger but when they return back home oh he's back for instance when the boss returns from a trip negotiating businesses you have people sit down and oh guy is back whereas nations and kings and presidents were the people who escorted that man to make deliberations at a national level today we have the honor of celebrating a woman who came from this nation and now is representing the world at a global scale i say this respectfully let the same person return to certain circles in this nation and you will be surprised the level and the extent of disdain for some reason there is a weakness in africa for some reason there is a weakness in this nation we have a way of trivializing great things we respect wickedness we respect viciousness when people are very mean and unfriendly they seem to command our respect but once you have a heart that is loving a leader that is thoughtful a businessman that is empathetic for some reason it's a weakness we must be delivered from as i'm speaking many of you are looking at your companies now you're looking at your businesses and you're saying my god if these people knew the plans that i had for them their dishonor deflated my passion to do more for them we must obtain grace this morning i was glad when they said unto me let us go to the house of the lord i have seen people who do not really qualify for certain contracts in this nation but their dishonor their dishonor were like extra certificates on their honor i meant to say this man is not deserving of this however you have done too well you have honored men you have honored systems you can honor your way to any realm and any dimension